Hi there again, this is Dr. J. Wrightlow. And if you're wondering why I look a little casual, it's because I want to talk to you a little bit about setting goals authentically based on your values. Now, one of my deepest values once a quarter is to pull out this guy and this guy and hop on an airplane with my family again once a quarter and go on a family vacation. So my top core value is family. My next core value is optimal human expression. My third is financial freedom. And my fourth value is adventure. I love, love, love to go on vacation with my family. Even though we've got three kids and it can be a bit of a, an adventure, sometimes to go on vacation, we make this one of our regular rhythms and routines. Um, and it's only for one week. Some people define success as two weeks or uh, being able to go and travel the world while they're working. That's not my definition of success. I actually value the stability of our house. I actually value the stability of being able to walk over to my bookshelf, pull a book off of it. So I also like the freedom of being able once a quarter to go and just reset myself with my family. So when you set goals, it's important that you go back to your core values have them written out, have them right in front of you, look at your values. So when you set your goals, you're really, really clear that you're not doing it because society says you should, because somebody else in your family says that you're supposed to do this a certain way. My brother, he should go on vacation for two months every summer. He's a teacher. So he works his butt off until summer comes around and summer comes around and he basically permanently has these guys in his hand. So that says his definition of success. This is my definition, my family's definition of success. So it's important, important that you do it from above, down, inside out. So from your brain out to the world, not from out to the world and into you. So above, down, inside out when you set those goals. Make sure they're clear, with, they're clear with your values. Also, one of the other things that maybe I neglected to speak on with the previous video and now is make sure that they're smart, specific, measurable, RA is aligned with your values, reasonable, and time sensitive. I want to be really, really clear that if you are not specific, smart with your goals, then how, how do you know if you're going to be able to achieve it? And, and here's the key. I heard, I heard this distinction once that somebody should be able to come into your life grab your goals or grab your values list and say, Jay Brightlow is living his life authentically and he's met these goals. They should be able to look, and right here, I've got a big one-year calendar. They should be able to look at that and say, did he go on that vacation? Did he, did he make that annual general meeting? Did he celebrate a huge victory with his staff? And they should be able to go, now I don't have the finances and the time piece, the, I don't have anything other than the time piece there. I don't have the financial piece there. Um, I don't have the house there. But you can get a really clear idea when you look at my life, you look at my goals, I either did or did not make that goal. So this, the, the more specific about the specific, measurable, aligned, reasonable, and time sensitive that you are, and again, the big one is that A, right in the middle of SMART, is the aligned through value system. Someone should be able to pick it up and just not know you, not know you from Adam, and say, yep, he pulled it out, pulled it out, and he had a great time. So. I'm uh, getting ready. I'm about three weeks from vacation, so I'm getting a little bit excited. I'm pulling out the beach clothes. I'm starting to pack up. This just happened to be right next to my desk, and so it was fitting today. So, again, this is Dr. J. Brett with Full Sword Coaching Consulting. Please let us know if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. Have a great day.